Hello everyone, it is I, Steven Ux, bringing you another discussion video on Sonic Boom. I believe this is my third one. So as you can tell, I am very excited for this game once again. But this discussion is actually going to be a response to a few comments, or actually a lot of comments, from my returning characters for Sonic Boom video. A lot of you guys seem to reply to that video and you seem to like it, so why not make a response to you guys? To my surprise, people were actually requesting Sally Acorn. Now if you aren't familiar with Sally, she's actually a character from the Sonic the Hedgehog comics published by Archie. She's also a recurring character in the Sonic the Hedgehog Sad AM series. So she has a huge fan base, even though she's never appeared in any of the games, to my knowledge. If she has, please you know, tell me. But this character seems to be very popular, and people want her in this Sonic Boom, you know, canon, this universe. So what's my take on it? Well, I don't think it's a bad idea. If you look at it this way, Sonic Boom starts fresh. I've mentioned this plenty of times. And with Sonic Boom, this makes three canons. We have the modern Sonic canon, the Archie canon, and now we have Sonic Boom. I feel like Sonic Boom can be that series that just combines both of them, you know? Not necessarily with plot devices, but character interaction and everything. We could have Sally Acorn, we could have Antoine, we could have Sonic, we could have Knuckles, we could have Shadow. It could all work out perfect. But in actuality, no, I just don't see this happening. When it comes to the comics, I like to think that they're very strict with their characters. I don't think they want them appearing in any of the games. Because for them, it'd just be weird. And it's not like they use the argument, oh, no one's never heard of these characters, they're too dated. Because people could just treat them like new characters. So you can't use the excuse that nobody will know who they are. But at the same time, I just believe a lot of legal reasons are what's gonna hold this back. So I do not believe Sally Acorn or any of the Archie characters will make an appearance in Sonic Boom. But I, along with other people, have my fingers crossed because I think it could be a great idea. Besides, just looking at Sally's design, it just reminds me of Sonic Boom. She looks all adventurous and she looks ready to be in this series. Am I joking around? But the real question is, what's your stance on this? Personally, I just, I don't see him in the game at all, to be honest. But the television show, I could see that working because Sally, along with other Archie characters, have made TV appearances. I could see them in Sonic Boom, the TV show. But I would like to know your stance on this. Are the Sonic comic characters worthy of being in Sonic Boom? I think so, but I just really Realistically, I just don't see it happening, but I'd love to know your stance. I'm Steven Ux, and I'll talk to you guys later.